thinking about trying to hold this one. What a call. Well done, Brian. Hey, well, you can see it in his eyes. You're in for a good week. Rom. It's going to look like a bunker shot. Long swing, slow acceleration. Just trying to get the ball in the, the club underneath the ball. What an exceptional wow. shot by John Rom. Look, it's hard to see him roll his eyes a little bit. It's hard not to smile. What a great shot by the world number two player with where that hole is. It's only 166 yards today. This hole can be backed up almost 200 yards with a new tee that's been built. He is dialed in with his iron. Back here at the Workday Charity Open, John Rahm in his last hole, the ninth from the fairway. Nice comes from, from Dylan Fratelli. He is one of four players back in the field this week who had previously tested positive for the coronavirus. Three of those four playing together for the first two days, as Todd Lewis explained, was Peter Malnati with his third. Another tough spot. Get in, get in, get in, get in. Yeah. Oh! Thank you. The bounce back. I love that. Double 17, a quick quick bounce back. Look at that card. A roller coaster. This tee shot just finished to this back portion of the green. Down the hill. Got a little bit of teach from Ricky Fowler's pitch. Ooh, curled it in right side. Just enough. Great birdie for Matthew Wolf. Back to back birdies at 15 and 16. This is Zhang, just off his third at the 10th, and he holds it out for birdie. But well, that'll get your blood pumping early in the morning. Oh, look at a tiny backswing. Must have had a pretty good line. Oh, he likes it. Do that. Is it? He oh, did it. Fowler! Yeah, Ricky for birdie. It was a perfect wide shot. It sure was. It he left him in a great spot it. to make birdie. Well, that looks good. Jordan wow. Spieth. That will get him to three under par. Now Patrick Reed up at the ninth from the first cut of rough. 132, and, and the bizarre thing is that the flag is blowing straight down now, but Patrick Reed being able to figure it out. Swing the club with the slope, not against it. Just sweep it up the slope like that. Ball pops out and goes in. Oh, in danger, but out of danger. What a par. Jason, what'd you be. make on the second hole today? Oh, I just made par. How'd you do? Give me a four. Wow. This is makeable. What a call, John. How about that? Victor was listening. Yes. Victor Holland holding out. He's got four birdies in his last five holes and five on the front nine. 14, make or break at 318 today. Hit a win. Hit a win. Wow, looks like he hit that over the wind. Look at this, Victor Hovland. Get in the hole. Good gracious a lot. That's a wonderful tee shot. There's a small backstop behind this whole location, but not much room behind it. So short is better than long here at the first. Send it back there. Oh, well played. Good start. GMAC, all right. Three under par. You ever seen a bad left-handed golf swing? <laughs> you know, watch this one. Look, look out! Oh, off the stick. Come in as shallow as you can and just try to pop it out. Only trying to hit this about three feet. Did he do it? Oh, look at the see. Another three All from that position. The tee shot. Man, I'm glad we're not wagering on this. It'd have, I'd be broke.
Already two birdies on the card. This for his third. Oh, what a great putt down the hill. Just dripping it in, as you like to say, Mark Wilson. Sun J.M. second shot at 17. You can see the flag whipping in the distance. Off the left. Oh, and a quality iron shot there. All right, Sam Burns. We have seen this putt miss left, and we've seen it miss right. No one's really come close to making it, except for right, Sam Burns. Nice going, Sam. 12 under. The even dozen under par. It's such a difficult putt. There's a ridge that runs just across that green and not getting away. But you say I got a chance. You're saying there's a chance. Very little. Brian Gay. Look at him roll that home. All right, it's time for me to go. It is. I'm gonna make something from left of the green, make your bogey, maybe make that par putt. But don't go flag hunting and try to make it up here. There's a penalty here to the right of the green. Oh, oh, do that. Oh, Are you kidding me? Just Holy Sabatini, that's a birdie. For birdie, Sabatini. This is Tim Wilkinson at the ninth. Okay. <laughs> They're going in from everywhere. Wilkinson with a birdie at nine to get to five under. Try to hit something about 10 feet short of the hole. Kind of like that. Man, Mark, that ball never left the flag stick. Just as straight as you can point. And after the drop, playing his fourth, Chase Seifert. It's a pitching wedge. There's a back and side board you can use here in the front hole location, Ian. Bad mistake there with the second, Mark. But a lovely shot here. Could this go in for a birdie? <laughs> yes, sir. Wow. That's the way to make four, Chase Seifert. <laughs> Worst Sabatini they did that on the second. It in the in the creek, took, dropped it out, and hold about a seven iron for a birdie. Unbelievable. Well, you can see swiped right across that like you do a widget on your phone. And in. Did you say widget? Widget on your phone, swipe across it. Onto the par five, 15th. Just outside of 23 feet, Brian. All about matching up the speed and the direction, and right when he needed it most. What a putt for an eagle three. Seven under par on his last eight holes. Hang on. You are joking. That one's gone the other way. My goodness. I'd have bet a lot on that one, Nick. <laughs> Yeah, Seinfeld must have been like another yard to the left and it def as we all saw it went left at the hole so he was just a fraction further over into the middle of the green and it changed it. Oh boy, a lot of head movement on that one. Oh, he went down and lost that. That'd be up on the hill. Yeah, way in above the rockers. It is up way on the up hill, there. although you can see a little bit of the golf ball. Wow, it's right in the back corner. He might like that next Sunday. Most definitely. Where do you expect to see that whole location? And it's quick after the halfway point because it's a 6% slope, 50 feet. So right now it will gather speed. Good weight. There's your two footer. Oh my goodness. All the oh way! Oh, can you believe that? I just got chills. How about you? 74 feet, 9 inches worth of putts hold in the two putts. We're back to 18 T. Not going right this time. Yeah, that's oh got a little boy. different shape to it. It better sit down, actually. Oh, nope, all good. Super. Yeah, three three wood won't reach the creek. Breeze flipped around for a brief bit, but now it's behind the players again. Go. 
That was six. Oh, look oh, where it hit a goodness. foot beyond the look hole. That. I just see after those last hole, can he win with a two? Yeah, he sees it. Left edge. Stay up. And off it goes. Oh. No problem with that. Third playoff hole coming up. Oh, it's going to be tight. That's very close. Might need, a, might need a kiss off the tree. Oh, no. That looks good now. Yeah, his usual hold off fade. What a shot. What a great shot. He gave him yardage beyond the hole. We heard him talk about 72. And that's right where that ball is. Gave it a great go. Could it be? Oh, 24 feet, three inches. Where did we find these two guys? <laughs> My goodness. They both looked like birdies all the way. Oh, he hammers that oh, one. Bullet. Oh, it's an ominous sign. 111 feet, all the ones. Could that be your champion with his all ones? It is very high and just left of the flag. Stay there. Well, he, know, he knows it. Been there before. Need to wheel this one in. It's got to go. Sheesh. You had 22 straight made cuts. Missed his first cut two weeks ago. Took a week off and straight back in the winner's circle. Colin Morikawa, second win on the PGA Tour. Great exhibition of tee to green golf over the last hour and a half.